CBB is celebrating 100 years since the suffragette movement, when women won the right to vote. To commemorate this historic occasion, women will be ruling the Big Brother house, with an all-female lineup. Many strong, independent female celebrities have entered the house, and one of these is India Willoughby. Click here to find out who else is in the CBB house here is all you need to know about the transgender newsreader, who is India Willoughby. India Willoughby, 51, is best known for becoming Britain's first transgender newsreader in 2016. Based in Newcastle, the talented newsreader has a teenage son called Rhodes. Before transitioning at the age of 50, she worked as an ITV regional reporter as Jonathan Willoughby. After 10 years of presenting news in Carlisle, Cumbria, Jonathan quit. Five years later the newsreader returned as India after transitioning to a woman. The brave star has been refreshingly open about her journey to where she is now. India said, I was too young to know about gender as a concept but I became aware of the difference between boys and girls and realized that I was on the wrong side. But in the 1970s to try to articulate that would have been ridiculous. So I decided to buckle down and make my mum happy. She described how she had felt like she was wearing a straight jacket while wearing men's clothes. After leaving her job as a regional newsreader, India ventured into a PR business in Newcastle, where she spent weekends living as a man, and weekdays as a woman. She said to Borders Telegraph, being trans was something I struggled with for many years, and caused me a lot of stress. For five years I led the secret double life, flip-flopping between male and female in two different cities. My family and friends completely oblivious to my alternate worlds. After becoming tired of living a double life, India returned to her family home in Cumbria. She said, I didn't want to lose my family and friends. What I did was I decided to split my life in two. I spent weekends as Jonathan in one city and I lived as the real me in Newcastle. India then told her son about her in a battle in a letter. India said, he said, it changes nothing, you're still my parent. He and his mother have been so supportive and ITV have been fantastic. India went to see her doctor about a gender reassignment surgery. Then began the two year long process which led to her sex change surgery. This included taking hormone blockers and estrogen to reduce facial and body hair. India said, it reached the stage where I was about to go in for surgery and I had to tell my family. It wasn't an easy thing to do, but they were great. I'd been able to live two parallel lives but you can't do that indefinitely. Since going public about her transition in Dior returned to TV as a panelist on Loose Women, a columnist, and has also had numerous other appearances including BBC One's Inside Out. India became the first transgender woman to be a panelist on an all-female talk show when she joined BBC Radio 4's Woman's Hour. The newsreader is still working for Border and Time Tees as a freelance reporter. Before entering the CBB house she said, I'm very much a people person, I can't wait to meet my fellow housemates. I've no idea who's going in the house, I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's terrific that Big Brother is actually doffing its cap to the suffragettes and everything they did 100 years ago, writes for which.